it where if you want something like fully customized and like okay you guys i just finished a call with the production team for planning my birthday party it went amazing i'm so excited i'm going to see the venue tomorrow i have to leave at 12 58 for the selena event the rare beauty thing so that's in like an hour i need to get ready and i'm gonna order some lunch really quick and i'm just posting some content that i need to post to instagram i'm gonna get ready now i think i'm gonna do natural makeup i just I'm not in the mood to do full glam i'm gonna do like glam but like natural glam putting on my christmas jams and i'm gonna get this makeup done All right, this is the full makeup, very glowy and natural. I'm gonna go pick out my outfit and then I'm gonna do my hair. I literally have no idea what to wear. I guess maybe jeans and like a cute sweater. I don't know, I'm gonna go look. I'm thinking this, these baggy jeans, plain white crop top and this like leather jacket. Okay, the chef just came and dropped off all of the meals. Eating a taco bowl that the chef dropped off. It's 12.30ish. I still have to do my hair. This is the fit, you guys. I need to figure out what shoes to wear. Maybe these. These could be cute, maybe. We're going to do the hair really quick. Cute. Okay, I'm putting my shoes on. I think I'm all ready to go. This is the outfit. These jeans are from Good American. Bottega belt. This is from Pixie Market, I think. This is Aloe. Bralette is Aritzia. Earrings are Bottega. And yeah, this is the outfit. My shoes are my New Balance. And I think I'm gonna go choose my bag. And that's it. Okay, I'm heading out the door. This is the bag I chose, this Shekmus one. And these YSL sunnies in the elevator. All right, guys, look at who I'm here with. Hi, the Selena. iconic Selena Gomez. <laughs> so you guys had a lot of questions for her, so I'm going to ask her and she's gonna answer. Yep. So what is one piece of advice you would give to somebody who's struggling with their mental health? Do not be afraid to ask for help and think about what you would say to your younger self. So true. I actually was thinking about it in the car. I was going to ask you, what's one piece of advice you would give to your younger self? Oh, man. I would just try to be nicer to myself. I think that I was a little too hard on myself. I feel like I was, too, when I was younger. Like, just critiquing every little thing. Everything. And now I'm just like, you know what? Relax. Do what, like, your body needs. Absolutely. And don't push yourself. Absolutely. The next question, how did you come up with the name Rare Beauty? So it was actually the name of my album and a song that uh, was released, the title track, and it's all about embracing who you are and you are unique and you are special the way you are. I love it. And I think it's like such a simple but unique name and it shows exactly what the brand is about. Thank you. Being so rare. So what would be your three desert rare beauty island products? Okay, probably my eye brightener that's out. It's very new. My tinted moisturizer and my my positive light silky highlighter. I love that. We're both wearing it. Mm. It looks gorgeous. I feel like those three products are perfect because it gives like a very glowy natural look. Right? We're making the island look up Right? Mm -hmm. We're pulling it together. Well, thank you so much for answering the questions. Thank you. You're amazing. Thank Guys, you. I'm here with Christine. Hi. I just got Selena. She is the sweetest human being ever. Aww. You're about to meet her. I'm so excited. But guys, look how pretty Meredith's glow looks. Look at it. I look matte compared to her. Oh my god, but we love a matte I do. I usually wear matte makeup all the time. We love a full coverage queen. But I'm, I'm glowing today, guys. Yeah. Love you. Love you. Guys, look who I'm here with. The 
iconic Michaela. We're having the best time. Yes. How was it with swimming? Incredible. She's oh, beautiful. She's so Literally. nice. She's, she's so nice. Right? I've met her before, yes. Yeah. I was so nervous. Oh, this is your first time? Yeah. Oh my god. I walked in and I was like, Did you like I, beautiful beautiful? Her. I was like, I'm so nervous. Oh. <laughs> no, she's she's awesome. so yeah. Like her skin, everything. No, she's so nice, you guys. But you guys. Hi. I feel like every time I open the camera, I'm like, look what I'm doing. <laughs> I get it. Everyone here is it's so no, cool. It's so Everyone nice. is so nice. Yeah, and it's so good to like see other creators because I feel yes. like we're just always on TikTok yeah. seeing each other and I'm like, wow, you're a real person. Yeah, I know. It's always so strange seeing everyone's way taller than I always think oh they God. are and I'm always like, I feel like I'm so Whoa. short. Okay. We're like kind of the same. You're a little, you're a little taller than me. Well, I thought like, you were going to be like 5'10". Really? Yeah. Swear. Oh my Swear. God. Well, here we are. Yeah, we no, had no. such an amazing time. Selena is so sweet, so kind. I yeah. love her. But yeah, we're having the best time. You guys, I just got home. Selena is the nicest person in the entire world. I cannot believe I met her. Like, we had one on one time in a hotel room. So it was like a penthouse suite. And then I got one on one time with her in a room. And she is so kind and nice and like caring. It was not transactional at all. Like, she's just so sweet. I was so nervous. My heart was racing. I was like, I cannot believe you're standing in front of me right now. Like, this is crazy to me that my career in TikTok has led me to this point in my life where I'm standing in front of Selena Gomez. Like, absolutely crazy to me. I asked her some questions and I wanted to ask like meaningful questions that I know that you guys would love and that I love and wanted to know her answers to those questions. So it was a really great experience. So thank you to the Rare team and to Selena for the opportunity. It's great seeing all the other TikTok creators there too that I always see online, but I don't actually get to like see in person. So it was a great experience, 10 out of 10 overall. They gave us this little goodie bag and the iconic earrings she wears in this campaign shoot are from Retrofat and they gave everyone their own personalized ones. I have a pair that says MD. Look at how gorgeous this is. I can't wait to wear them. I still cannot get over that I literally met Swing with them. I was like shook to my core. But I have a ton of packages here, so I'm gonna open those up for you guys and we're gonna go through them. Let me just show you guys really quick what they gave us in the goodie bag. So they gave us the Positive Light Silky Touch Highlighter in shade Flaunt. Look at how pretty that is. Mesmerize, pinky color. It is Exhilarate. I love these names. But that's pretty. It's like a champagne color. And Enlighten, really, really pretty as well. Okay, I'm trying it right here in front of the lighting for you guys. Ooh, oh my god. What? This is so pretty. This is the side before and after. What? Okay, and then they gave us the Positive Light Under Eye Brightener. Love this packaging. And I love that the tip is like this metal tip. And then they gave us a Lip Souffle Matte Lip Cream. This is cool packaging, it's like a matte. That is gorgeous. Okay, first package is from Skin Fix. That's pretty, it says love on it. They sent their Barrier Moisture Rich Hydrating Cream and their Replenishing Cream. Next, I got this skirt from Lioness. Just this pretty black silk skirt. Next package is from Valentino Beauty. I'm loving this. Like, it's like a little clutch. I feel like I could use this as a bag. This is what they sent, so this highlighter. So gorgeous. How cute is that with the little Valentino V on it? This is a blush and a highlighter. Then they sent a lipstick. This is so pretty for the holidays and I love this texture. And then they sent a little mini perfume. Thank you, Valentino Beauty. Next package is from Mango. Got this really cute jacket. Obviously it's faux fur, but Cute, I love it. Next package is from Kato. They're an event planning company, they're great. Dear Meredith, we hope you love your very own collector's item cereal. Meredith Puffs. Oh my God, what? This is so cute. Oh my, oh my God. Help Meredith find her kiss lashes. That is so creative and Wait, cute. Wait, what? That scanned me to see more of what Meredith is up to. This is so freaking I love cute. That. Oh my god, it goes to my Instagram when you scan it. 
So this is the dress that is on the cereal box. And look at how cute it is. Meredith Puffs. <gasps> I am putting this in my beauty room, putting it on a shelf. Like, look at how insane. Thank you so much, Kato. This is so sweet of you guys. Like, this just is so creative. And I can't believe that I got sent this. Got to be glue. <laughs> this is my favorite product. Got to be glue, you guys know. I use it all the time. I use the spray hairspray and like the spray gel let's open her up wow you guys i am stocked up and i'm excited to try out these new products that i haven't tried before because like i'm a got to be stan i use their product so much it's like the only thing that will hold my sideburns back when i shaved my sideburns off and they were growing out this baby Kept them in place, so. This package is from my Teresa. I ordered these Attico boots from. I feel like I've been struggling to find a perfect black boot and I feel like I've found it. Love the heel on these, super unique, but also fun. So I ordered some Saint Laurent glasses. Obsessed with these, are you kidding me? Next, I got some tights from Wolford because these will be good for New Year's outfits, and yeah, just got a few pair. They're in black though, not nude. Wolford and Mugler tights, which are really cute. They have like a slit down the middle. Okay, I think I got sent the wrong shoe. I ordered these YSL heels, and I, oh no, I think I just ordered the wrong one. Okay, so they're patent leather. I wanted the non-patent leather, but these are cute too. I'm gonna try these on. Wow, I actually love these. These are so cute. Last package, my apartment is filled to the brim with boxes right now. If you guys don't know, I have a shoe obsession. My boyfriend hates it because it takes up so much space. <laughs> and I'm taking over his closet, but I got two more pairs of shoes from the Attico. I love the Attico. I've been wanting a pair of their jeans, but they're like sold out everywhere. So I got patent leather pair of heels. I just love this heel right here, it's so pretty. And I've been needing a white heel, so I got them in white as well. And it's like a matte white. Brandon's home. He's having a snack. I'm enjoying a good pepper with hummus. Gotta eat healthy. And we're gonna go to the Bryant Park Christmas markets. So I'm gonna change out of my clothes. I'm gonna get something comfy on. And I'm gonna clean up all the packages I just opened. And then we're gonna head to the markets. Ramp it. Brandon lets him jump all over him, so then he's naughty. Okay, Brandon and I decided we're not gonna go to the Bryant Park Winter Village. We're gonna save it for another day and make a vlog out of it because I feel like I've done a lot today already and I have a lot to do still. So I'm gonna take pictures of all the PR so I can post it to my Instagram stories and then I'm gonna start cooking dinner. Have to make the picture look cute. We gotta light the candle. Crumpet sees himself on camera. All right, you guys, we're gonna eat really healthy fish for dinner. Meredith got lemon caper fish, and I got red snapper. It's gonna be great. Looks so good. Using the sweet basil field farmer marinade for the red snapper. Wow, Brennan did an amazing job. You guys, I was cleaning up my yogurt from this morning and look at what happened. It's okay, accidents happen. We'll help clean it up. Brennan got out the air fryer and we're gonna air fry these sweet potato fries. Now I'm gonna take all of these clothes and shoes upstairs. Snapper looks so good. I always made fun of Brennan for wanting it because it's just, just so random. But we're gonna split half and half of each. Looks delicious. So the chef did drop off food today, so technically I should be eating his meals tonight. But I bought this fish yesterday, so I'm not gonna waste it. Oh, I want a little side of veggies with this spinach dip. So I think I'm supposed to heat it up. I'm gonna put it in the microwave. You guys already know what we're gonna be watching. White Lotus, of course. Oh, thanks. Bye. 
I just got out of the shower. I'm gonna do my hair. I'm gonna put this Olaplex number nine bond protector hair serum in it. So we started watching White Lotus season two and honestly, I like season one way better. I'm only on episode one of season two, but I feel like I like the storyline better of season one. I don't know, I just I just like the characters better in season one. I don't know, I'm liking season one better. Let me know your thoughts below because I'm curious to see what other people think. Putting on my Laneige lip sleeping mask. Guys, if any of you are dealing with hair breakage and have a solution, please let me know because I have so much hair breakage as you guys can see. And I'm getting my hair dyed again on Friday, um, which is just gonna break it even more. I've heard a lot of people take Wellbell supplements. I guess I'm gonna look into it. Please let me know if you have any solutions because I'm so over the hair breakage. It is 10, 12 p.m. Brandon and I are watching White Lotus. We're just relaxing. Probably gonna go to bed soon. We're super tired. See you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 15. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed. I love you guys so much and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.